Hi, this is Natalie Rice from here from sportsbookreview.com. We have now reached the semi-finals of the 2015 French Open. And in this video, we're going to preview the men's semi-finals taking place tomorrow with Alex from Boom Betting Agency. Alex, first of all, how did you get, have you been overall with your men's betting? Overall, uh, I think that uh, now we are uh, somewhere at uh, 18 units uh, on profit. This is huge. Uh, but um, combined with the previews done uh, with you, and uh, with the Twitter uh, live in play action that we are doing every day for, from the beginning of uh, Roland Garros till now. So 18 uh, units profit uh, for uh, almost now how many days they are? Uh, 10 days. I think it's a huge profit only from uh, tennis and only from a tournament. Yeah, great. Yeah, perfect. And we've done. We've been doing so well here at SportsWorldReview.com with all our tennis coverage, really making some profit here. But let's see how we get on now, previewing the semi-finals. And let's start with the first match of the day, and that's Joe Wilfried Songa versus Stan Wawrinka, uh, with Wawrinka being the favourite, 1.44. Who do you see winning this match? Uh, I saw that the odds are going uh, down little by little for uh, Wawrinka. Uh, his favorite, of course. Uh, he did a perfect tournament till now. And most of all, he didn't give any chance to Federer in the quarterfinals. He won 3-0 uh, straight sets. He has a really solid game and his backhand with one hand is ab absolutely amazing. He's the favorite in front of Tsonga, but we should not forget that uh, Tsonga is French and the public uh, this time will be more than uh, uh, in the other matches with him and will support him every for every point so i think that um, it will be a different match for vavrinka he doesn't like uh, the fact that the public is against him uh, and uh, he might uh, have uh, some issues uh, from that point of view i think that he will win the, the match after all because uh, he is uh, better in uh, in terms of shape and uh, he is uh, more relaxed because uh, Tsonga in the quarterfinals he played he played the five setter but uh, Vavrinka played uh, three sets uh, very fast uh, um, in front of Federer. So uh, I see more uh, games and uh, I think that uh, this time we'll, uh, we will bet, not only this time, most of our, our bets were on the number of games uh, played in the match. So I think that also for this match we'll go going to play the number of uh, games. All right. How many games in the match are we looking at? I, I think that um, the best uh, odd uh, that I found uh, all over the book is uh, it's over 39.5 games in the match. Price somewhere uh, depends from bookie to bookie at uh, 1.8, 1.83. All right. Now then we've got Novak Djokovic, who is the predicted winner of the French Open, and Andy Murray, uh, who will battle it out for the final spot here. Any chance of the upset? On uh, how uh, Novak Djokovic is playing right now and uh, how he passed Nadal without winning, uh, without losing any set in uh, this entire tournament, he is com coming to the semi-finals in front of uh, uh, Andy Murray. And Andy Murray, that uh, the same with Novak Djokovic, didn't lose any match on clay uh, this uh, this year. So only the two of them never lost a match in clay this year. Uh, like that, the statistics are saying to us. But uh, Novak with uh, some plus um, on, uh, on his shape and on his form. Uh, I saw Murray having ups and downs uh, all over the entire tournament. Um, he lost some sets uh, in front of some uh, easy opponents. But uh, all the time Novak Djokovic has problems in playing of, with Murray. So I think that uh, Murray will take the first, uh, the first set uh, or Djokovic will lose the first set in uh, this entire Roland Garros, but uh, I think that uh, Djokovic, after all, will uh, will win the game. So this time, at this match specifically, we will gonna play the number of sets. I'm saying over 3.5 sets in the match, priced uh, at 1.83. So this is why I'm saying that uh, we should have at least uh, four sets in the match. All right, and is that sort of like the best way then to play that uh, that, that match, Novak Djokovic versus Andy Murray? Or uh, it's another thing uh, that I will play with uh, less uh, stake. Uh, I think a minimum stake I will put uh, Novak Djokovic to win 3-1. Mm -hmm. uh, the match has priced at another of uh, 3.75. Okay, fantastic. So now just to recap for our viewers here, Alex, what are the top tips for betting the men's semi-finals? So Wilfried Tsonga with uh, Stan Wawrinka um, 
at, we are playing over 39.5 uh, games in the match priced at 1.8 and uh, Novak Djokovic versus Andy Murray we are going to play over 3.5 sets in the match priced at uh, 1.83. All right, fantastic. And if you want to follow our in-play tennis betting, do head on over to our Twitter page there, SBR Sports Picks. Uh, there's a lot of action happening over there. Do be sure to check it out. Alex, thank you for joining us today. Thank you for the invitation, Ed.